Welcome back to PSC Tech Buy. Today we keep on talking about how to set up a Micro 365 Edu tenant. And specifically, in order to do that, you need to register a custom DNS name for your school. You have to register a trial license of Micro 365 Edu, as we saw in the previous episode. And then you need to use the admin UI of Micro 365 to register your custom DNS domain name as well as uh, you will use the same admin UI to open a ticket uh, in order to request the upgrade to a full uh, education tenant uh, license for your uh, Maxo 365 Edu tenant. Moreover, you will also need to configure users, uh, teachers, uh, staff and faculty and you will have uh, to configure classes and uh, teams. We will cover today the first part of the story and in the next episode we will see how to sync uh, users, uh, teachers and stuff like that. So, let's move to the demo environment and let's configure, let's set up the Microsoft 365 Edu tenant. So, here we are in the admin portal of the uh, demo education tenant that I created and showed you in the previous episode. And now I want to configure a custom domain. So, I already registered a custom domain called myschool.mobi in GoDaddy or you can use whatever provider you like to do that and I'm going to configure my uh, tenant accordingly. So I can go to show all of the uh, settings uh, and click on settings, domains, and here I can add a custom domain. My custom domain will be myschool.mobi. I will use this domain. The uh, Office 365 management UI is able to understand that it is hosted under GoDaddy, so I can use uh, an automatic verification process. By clicking on verify, I will have to authenticate with my GoDaddy credentials. I can connect, and by doing that, uh, Microsoft 365, uh, using a set of APIs, will do the actual configuration and verification of the domain uh, for me. And that's it. So I can just click on... Uh, uh, these uh, more options if I want to see what I want to do, but I can let Microsoft add my DNS record, which is the recommended option. So I will click on continue and uh, the settings will be configured in my target tenant by Microsoft 365, by the admin UI of Microsoft 365. So I can simply click on add DNS record and my target uh, DNS zone will be configured accordingly. Of course, I need to consent uh, to apply those settings to my target DNS zone. So once I've done that, my domain is fully configured. I can click on done and now I can use a user account in my school.mobi uh, tenant. Once I've done that, I can go to uh, the support section and I can create a new service request. I can search uh, for a specific topic, but I can also create a new ticket by clicking right here. And by doing that, let me first make a request like uh, I'd like uh, to upgrade to full edu license. Let me search for it. And once I've seen the search results, I can click on this button, contact support, and I can send my request, which will be whatever you like, something like please upgrade my trial tenant uh, to a real full edu tenant. You will provide your contact information and that's it you will wait for a few hours or days and you will get your trial tenant upgraded to a full Microsoft 365 education tenant. Like always, thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it interesting and I'm really looking forward to seeing you next week. And remember to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.